Hey guys, Dr. Robin here. I'm gonna take you inside with me of the cryotherapy chamber today. And I'm turning it on and uh, gonna get it started right here. So let's check it out. Got our nitrogen on, getting it started. And the cool thing about this is we can set it at a certain times. So for people for the first time, we don't have to go to three minutes, 180 seconds. We can do as little as 30 seconds and keep going from there. So I'm kind of used to it now, so I'm gonna do 180. And you can do it at a temperature, negative 110 Celsius up to negative 190, which is what I'll do. And um, we start it usually lower for people for the first time. So I'm gonna hit the start cooling button and uh, you'll see me inside the chamber. So it's cooling right now, as you can see, it actually just uh, got down to negative 190. So I'm gonna go in there and uh, make sure I have someone watching me as well. All right, so I am now in the chamber here, cryogenic chamber. Got my nice gloves on here, and uh, it's set to go. So Carla's gonna hit the button here, and uh, woo, there we go. Set for negative 190, and uh, it's nice and brisk for sure. Uh, definitely in here, you wanna make sure you're looking up, breathing in the oxygen, number one thing, uh, very important. But um, people ask, you know, what does it feel like? And I say, like, I've never done this, but I would imagine, like, if you lived in Canada, and it was the middle of the winter in a snowstorm and you went to go get your uh, mail naked. Um, I feel like that would probably be what it feels like, but you actually have uh, kind of you know socks and uh, your hands are warm and your feet are warm. Um, so we wanna go ahead and move about every 15 or 30 seconds just to whew, uh, get, you know, just not stay in the same position. But I can kind of take you under here and you can see it just basically fills up with uh, that liquid nitrogen and um, probably at about a minute so far. So, so what is it doing? So basically uh, the really cool science behind this is that it's tricking your brain into thinking you're going into hypothermic shock. So, but it's actually not injuring you because of nitrogen you're drying here as being uh, opposed to being, you know, falling in like a frozen uh, water or something like that where that will actually penetrate and freeze your organs and kill you. So this actually uh, brushes off the skin and uh, tricks those thermoreceptors that detect temperature into thinking that you actually just fell into frozen you know, water um, when you actually didn't. So you don't get injured from it, but what happens is the body sets off that alarm response, which is that uh, norepinephrine uh, release. Uh, norepinephrine is a powerful anti-inflammatory. Uh, it helps with uh, bringing blood to the, to the brain to the uh, muscles so you can survive a tough situation, uh, blood to your heart so you can survive a, a, what it thinks is a life-threatening situation. I'm gonna turn again. And there's Carla watching me. You always want someone watching you. Um, so basically that also is a, is a powerful anti-inflammatory, uh, helps to trigger the hypothalamus in the brain to release growth hormone uh, to repair what it thinks is an injury. And um, also a lot of endorphins are released because endorphins get released when you're in a painful situation to help you uh, survive. So when you get out, you feel a lot different. You feel a lot better. Uh, it's pretty interesting. So this is really good for anybody with arthritis, with um, certain autoimmune issues, uh, even great for, they've said depression because of the mood enhancement. Um, good for any injury, chronic or acute. Uh, really awesome way to hopefully get people off of pain medication. Um, now it's starting to really get cold. But uh, yeah, so I'm getting approaching three minutes and I um, feel pretty good. But uh, definitely a great thing if you have any injuries you're trying to recover from, uh, if you're working out real hard and just want to recover from a long exercise week, uh, or if you have any sort of um, arthritis or inflammatory conditions. So now it's all done and um, the nitrogen is leaving the chamber and I'm gonna put my robe back on. And obviously I talked through that whole thing so uh, it's not too bad. So stepping out of the chamber, and you can see it just basically looks like a snowstorm blizzard just happened in there. But uh, I feel really good. Um, I feel like uh, just basically a lot of energy right now, just from, you know, that kind of wakes you up. Uh, it's kind of invigorating. So um, a great thing to, to try out. Uh, we have it here now at Sports Chiropractic. It's not so bad, and we can change the settings too for you. But uh, Come give us a call uh, when you'd like to try it out.